It's the fifth day since the memorial altar for the Itaewon incident has been set up at Seoul Plaza. And people continue to visit the memorial altar set up nationwide for those who lost their lives in the Itaewon crowd crush. Our Che Min Jung joins us from the Seoul Plaza memorial altar. Min Jung. Good morning, Doyan. As you said, I'm here at Seoul Plaza, where one of the memorial altars has been set up since Monday. It's a very chilly morning, but people have already come to pay their tributes in silence. Uh, so far, as of Thursday evening, a total of more than 96,000 people have paid their respects to the victims at memorial sites set up in the capital. We saw more than 19,000 people offer their condolences in Seoul yesterday alone. And President Yoon Song yeol has been visiting this altar in the past few days, and the president of Germany, Frank uh, Walter Steinmeier, who is on a short visit to Korea, also came here to Seoul Plaza this morning to offer his condolences. Former Japanese Prime Minister Taro Aso also paid an in-person tribute yesterday, and other public figures, including Seoul Mayor Oh Se-un and a number of ambassadors to South Korea, visited the altar here at Seoul Plaza to pay, to pay tribute as well. Now, Min Jung, the, the whole nation is still grieving and in shock. Can you give us some updates on the figures related to the victims as well as funeral arrangements? And as of Thursday morning, uh, Thursday evening, that is, the number of deaths remains at 156. As we already know, 130 of them are Koreans and 26 are foreign nationals. Among the injured, 38 people are still being treated at local hospitals, and 33 of them are reportedly in serious condition. Official safe funerals have been held for at least 128 people, and of them, seven foreign nationals have been returned to their home countries. Several memorial altars have been set up in 25 districts of Seoul where people can continue to pay tribute until this Saturday, which is the last day of the week-long national mourning period. The altar here at Seoul Plaza is open from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m., but people can come here and pay their respects outside these hours as well. That's all for now, but I will be back for our 11 a.m. newscast. Toyan. All right, thank you, Min Jung, for that report.